So no signs at this point that this guy could be completely different than what you thought. No. Now, I read somewhere he ended up losing his license. Yes. When did that happen? That happened. Um, and did he ever have his own practice or did he work for other people? Oh, well, when he started, he uh, he always had his own practice. So, but he would go into, like, he would work in, say, like a dentist office in Manhattan. And he would rent space and they would have, like, a nice... Um, Referral process. Yeah, like that. So he never This is more serious than what I can do. Please see this oral surgeon. He'll take care of you. Right, exactly. Okay. He never wanted to work for anybody. He always wanted to have his own thing. You know. um, Smart guy. I mean, how did he end was. up losing the damn license? Um, drugs. Good old drugs. Yeah, he, uh, he got hooked on the coke. Um, well, not the coke, but... <laughs> <he> <laughs> did you ever really see did. him when you were dating ever do drugs? Um, Don't lie. I'm not saying you do. Okay. But the truth. The truth. Because the 80s was like, All yo, right. what up, man? Yo, fuck. Yeah. Yo, another fucking <laughs> bunk. Like, I mean, we see. <laughs> that's how the 80s In were. Between okay, sentences. Okay, this <laughs> is fucking cocaine was like rampant. Well, this is. Still a, is. But did, not like, yeah. I mean, the 80s was like, when I hear it was like a fucking so field. It's like the coke you, era. You right heard there. it first here. Because he. <laughs> told you I'm a good fucking. I told you guys. You got, follow me, you man. got the question. I'm coming for 2020. There's nothing written here. There's five normal it's questions. Not, it's not even in the book. It's like Barbara Walters. I'm coming for 2020. Go ahead. All right. So as I we were, I was dating him, we were in love, all that. He said, you know, you want to try some Coke? I never did it in my life. Never. Even now? Uh, no. Like I'm I, saying like ever. You've never done it. No, meaning I have never. But at that point. Up to I that never, point, you had never tried it. I never tried it. Up, and? up until that point. Right? Okay. So then he, then ahead, he, goes, he goes, you want to you wanna, you wanna wanna try some? Yeah, want to try? You know, we had gone to a movie dinner. Want a little flaca? <laughs> I don't even know what he called it. But did you take the bump or not? I did. Were you scared before you did it? I was curious. Like I was like, all right, well, I've never tried it, but okay, I'll try it. And did you like it? Don't fucking. No, lie I got to sick. I got a respiratory infection. <laughs> <laughs> that was it. You never did it again. It's probably that's probably the only favor he did you besides giving you these two beautiful boys. That's it. I. You know, because no. he made you hate it after that. Because <laughs> exactly, I never tried it ever. Do you know why? Why? Terrified I'd like it. Oh really? Absolutely oh. terrified yeah, that I would like it, that, that I would oh, love it. I'd probably sure. be dead. Wow. See, for me, I I didn't think that I would have any kind of problem. I I knew that no matter what, I could I was walk terrified. Away from really? If I All like right. something, I like it. You know, look at food. Look I, at me. addictive personality. Look at the, look at the food. Listen, I'd be so, dead in three days. So, but you, <laughs> like, where's Beck? He did coke. No. I know that you're interviewing me, but I just have a question for you. Please. This is a two-way <laughs> conversation here. All right. I tend to do this. Um, so did you see a lot of people, the people's demise from cocaine? Yes, I did. And that's why you... you Some of them very try. close. Right. Okay. And Terrified then, me. And then you would never try it. I okay. dated a girl who, at, before I dated, she was a Brooklyn girl. Before I dated her, some, and it was a very brief relationship with this chick, but the little bit that I got out of her, the guy before me had lost an empire doing cocaine. The guy had like five dealerships in Brooklyn. Really? Lost everything, and I think he at last had died from it. Or he had definitely lost his entire life. Like his wealth, everything went down his nose. Yeah. Up his nose, I should say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, wow. you know, that's just one example. But, I mean, I was just always scared of it. Not that I'm a chicken. Yeah. But I know sometimes, you know, I know my limits. I know what I can it's, handle. It's good to know your limits. Sometimes I'm, you know, yeah, like sometimes I was you don't crazy. even need to try ones. Like I've never even taken one. Oh, because God cigarette. forbid you yeah. like it. I mean, just because there's like lo bad, like lung history, it destroy family, your life. So I, just, yeah. yeah, cigars are amazing. You don't have to inhale. Just be somewhere very well ventilated, but don't start smoking. Yeah. <laughs>